Hey, welcome back to the next section for our C Sharp Level 2 class. In this section, we're going to explore the idea of recursion. And so my point of the lessons of, of this section is to show you demonstrations of examples of how recursion works. And so we're going to create some graphical illustrations using something with a binary tree, a Hilbert curve, which is shown here, and also some, some fractal snowflakes. Then we'll do some more text-based uh, recursion examples. We'll create a function called count to one, and a factorial, and a greatest common factor. These are all math equations. And then finally we'll finish with a, a flood fill example. So I call this thing Candy Crush, even though it's just a bunch of squares. But it will demonstrate how to do a flood fill. As you can see on the screen, when you click on a region, the, uh, the flood fill is to paint all of the buttons the same color that you clicked until it reaches a natural boundary. And so you can see that I clicked a red square and all of the squares in the adjacent areas were painted red. And so this will work exactly as you would expect in the recursion of a milestone of our, uh, of our uh, Minesweeper program. And so in the region in, in Minesweeper, if you click and there are no bombs nearby, the whole area is cleared. It's, uh, it's shown to be uh, free of bombs. And so we're going to program this as our recursion flood fill code for um, Minesweeper. 